We played very well on the road. We got to come home and bring that same game home. And uh, it's a good stretch for us of home games. And you know, when we've been on the road as much as we have, there's we've complained about it. So now you can't complain about it. You got to get to work at home. So uh, it's an opportunity for us to get some practice time and hopefully play well on our home ice. Approaching the midway point of the season, just in general, are you pleased with where this team is in the standings as it relates to the Pacific Division and possible playoffs? Well, and as it relates to the division, sure, we're in a playoff spot, so you uh, you like that. But there's uh, it's been up and down a little bit, you know, some due to injury, but some uh, our play. And uh, you know, we had the five game streak where we didn't play very well, and then uh, we've had times like you look at the last road trip. I thought we played very well in, in all three games. So our game is uh, continuing to grow, and that was our goal at the start of the year: is just make sure that we're. Uh, a very competitive team and grow some younger players and uh, the way it's going we've, we've got some veteran players that have jumped right along with it. Is that okay to talk about that Dave and you know you kind of like Thursday that was a big game everyone embraced it and you got two points and you were better off for it I mean is that okay to talk about this is where we are this is big this I mean is yeah. that that uh, rally a group? And yeah you you gotta you gotta recognize what you're doing and, and where you are and you know we have a young team a lot of young players there that um, if you don't talk about those things, they might not get noticed. So there's ebbs and flows of the season, and uh, you're always trying to push yourself to that next level of what it is. And, and sometimes, like a game like that one the other night, was, was a very important game to a team that's right behind you in the standings. And it's important that not just you talk about it, it's important that you do it. And that's, that was the good thing about the other night. We, we recognized the situation, and we played accordingly. That's why we're hoping this homestand, you come in, the first game of the homestand, you come back, you recognize the importance of how uh, this stretch of games is for us. We talk about it and let's go out and play accordingly. Is that a sign of the growth that maybe you've seen in that they can accept that, recognize, deliver, you know, and heed that, but then like go yeah, and I mean, do it's it? A, it's a sign of growth of your team as it goes on through the season, you know, not, I mean, that's just the whole, you're, you're trying to build the mindset of your group. And a day to day, and you try to improve day to day. That's uh, those are things that have to be part of it. Do you ever play in the pack mentality card again? But in part because of what we saw in Calgary, how good of an example was that in terms of defending, defending in layers, and everybody doing what they were supposed yeah. to do? It was uh, probably one of our most complete games where we just we wanted to play a real hard game and uh, limit the other team's ability to make plays through the neutral zone, things like that, that make us a good team. Uh, goes back, we made some good saves. You know, we need we need strong goaltending with that. So, uh, real solid game. That's what the conversation was this morning. We have to bring that game home. Two words that uh, we've heard described around Louis Domain, calm and confident. Is that kind of the two most important words you want to see about a goalie? Yeah, it's, he's carried himself very well. He's worked real hard in practice. In the games, he's just, uh, he just, Goes out there and does his job. Nothing flashy about it. Just, just been real solid. So uh, uh, he's been a real, you know, a real solid player for us here this last little stretch. It's interesting to hear him talk about his experience a year ago to now, just in terms of preparation and understanding. How much uh, have you seen in terms of growth from him? Well, every like the experience he got last year, just being in the NHL for as long as he was, even though he wasn't playing as much as he's doing now. Uh, you know, your day-to-day -day preparation, your day-to-day -day thought process is there's a lot of things there to remember. So he's coming in, he's not in awe of anything. He knows how to prepare. He knows how a number one goaltender should prepare. And, you know, the last couple of weeks here, you've seen, like, he's just, he's got himself playing well and he's just uh, going about his business as a, as a real good player.